a rally addressing a pressing issue in Brazil, hunger. It's far from over, these volunteers shout. That is because in one of the world's largest food producers, many still don't get enough to eat. It was organized by a Sounda Cidadania, Citizenship Action, Brazil's oldest and largest anti-hunger movement, currently celebrating its 30th anniversary and launching one more Christmas food campaign. What we do on this, this campaign, Christmas Without Hunger, is to, to bring attention to the, the, the theme. So the population can once again understand that we're still in hunger uh, and that we need to fight it. Uh, that's something that's, it's, I, I mean, it's crazy that we have to keep saying that again and again and again because people think that people eat only on Christmas. They've done a heroic job collecting a total of 55,000 tons of food donations in this Rio warehouse over three decades. Every October, the Christmas food campaign kicks off to bring relief for the end-of-year holidays. Ending hunger is now a top priority in Brazil, but the trends here seem to be moving in the opposite direction. According to a recent United Nations report, nearly one-third of Brazilians are currently suffering from some form of food insecurity. In absolute numbers, the study shows more than 70 million Brazilians did not always have enough to eat between 2020 and 2022. Scenes of hungry people in Brazil's urban centers have become more common, even though the country has resumed its anti-hunger program. We went out of the, we got out of the uh, ONU United Nations hunger map in 2014 because we have, a, we had a public policy against hunger, and that was destroyed in the last five years. And together with COVID a pandemic, we are now in this situation. We have the knowledge, we know how to do it, how to fight hunger. We've done it before. It's not magic, it's not a miracle, it's just political will. The rally ended with a festive event for the little ones. The organizers say it's a way to show Brazilians must work together from an early age to start breaking once and for all Brazil's cycle of hunger and inequality. Lucrecia Franco, CGTN. Rio de Janeiro.